Hi everybody, my name is Milani Hache and I'm an executive director with Epicure. Today I wanted to show you how come I love my multi-purpose steamer so much. Uh, if you've uh, followed me already on a couple of my videos, I always recommend that the three little um, hair vents that we have on top, that you don't point them towards your face. You wouldn't want to, hit, to get a lot of uh, uh, heat on your face. So once I'm gonna open the lid, you're gonna see there's a lot of steam. I'm gonna open it, you can see. Perfect, so what I love about this multi-purpose steamer is that it comes with a multi-purpose tray. And today I actually uh, did something cool and I'm gonna try to take it out now. Grab a couple of utensils here. Um, so I actually placed my multi-purpose tray on top I have put potatoes on the bottom and on top I put some uh, frozen veggies and I'm going to transfer them in my plate here. There. Okay. I'm just going to do this for now. So the fun part is that my veggies, oh, they're not properly cooked, but I'll just add a I'll just add a minute or two afterwards. Just put them back in the steamer. But yeah, just wanted to show you that it's really nice. And the other thing, because I've had a, a customer that asked me about this, and the veggies are not cooked because I cooked the potatoes before, and the potatoes were almost uh, good to go. And I thought, oh, well, I should have put my veg my veggies. So I should have put them both at the same time. So then it would they would be ready. Uh, so multi-purpose steamer, which is awesome. I have my potato uh, masher it, in the catalog. It's called the meat uh, separator, but for me, I'm gonna call it my potato masher for today because as you can see, I can actually mash my potatoes. So this is awesome. And I'm gonna grab my phone so you can see what I'm doing here. Oops, maybe not. Can I flip? Right here. As you can see, you can mash your potatoes using your meat separator. So that was my little tip for today. I'm gonna finish this up, put some little oat milk in it, a little bit of a butter, make them really creamy, and then I'll add my veggies for another two minutes for them to be ready. Uh, so transferring my potatoes in another bowl. So really easy, really uh, tasty potatoes in a few minutes. Have a good day.